Auckland's hub for the homeless is getting a makeover. In the new building we're going to have all our current services and we're also building an apartment to complete. There is going to be 80 people living in those apartments. 40 of those will be for people who have formerly been uh, rough sleepers that we will support into long-term accommodation. So this is a wonderful venture for the City Mission and for Auckland generally and really looking forward to the next couple of years and all that will unfold. The homeless in Auckland seem pretty happy about it too. Well, I went there the other day and from what I got from them, they've got a whole lot more services that will be able to help us a lot more. So I'm really happy about that. They've got a mental health nurse in there now, so that'll be very helpful for the ones with mental health, like me. I've got mental health, I'll be honest. So I'm looking forward to meeting her and interacting with her. There's a lot more um, facilities, there's a lot of feed, there's a lot of, it's, it's um, compared to the other one. I'm just comparing though, but um, yeah, no, nah, it's good, it's good. This means for the next two years, the City Mission will have a new temporary home. The Auckland City Mission is relocating 700 metres down the road from the old Hobson Street building to Union Street. With at least 3,600 people homeless in Auckland, this can't come soon enough. Grace Denton, Te Wahinui.